Hello and welcome to another What's Inside. This time we are looking at Zombicide 2nd Edition Chronicles Survivors. These are survivor minis from the role-playing game that you can use in your board game. So we got 12 survivor miniatures here, plus 12 ID cards. It's from Cool Mini or Not and Guillotine Games in 2020. And these were, I think, Kickstarter exclusives. So let's take a look at these and see what we've got. This does require the core Zombie Side Second Edition game to use. Uh, you could use them with the role playing game, I guess, but if you really want to get the most out of this, you want to have the board game. Alright, so here's our cards, and here's our minis. So let's take a closer look at these, and see what we've got. Alright, first up we have this guy on the bike. It's number 58, according to the bottom. That's actually a pretty cool looking sculpt. Next up, we have number 59. Another cool sculpt. These all look really cool, actually. Then we've got number 65. He looks like Brock Sampson from Venture Brothers. Dual wielding baseball bats. Alright, then we've got our guy in the wheelchair here, this combat wheelchair. This is some incredibly good detailing. I didn't think they would do as well on the detailing on this one as some of the others. But you can actually see the treads and the wheels and stuff like that, so pretty cool. Then we've got number 66 here. And 67. Next up, we have number 60. Number 64. Number 62. It's like the lunch lady went nuts. Number 63. Number 68. And lastly, number 69. She's got like some body armor or something on. Like I said, the sculpts look good. And really nicely made, high quality. Look pretty sturdy. Alright, that's all the minis. So let's take a look at our cards. All right, 
So first up we have our um, Amato. That's the guy with the bike. I can block some of that glare. Next up we have Ben. We have Aaron. Next up, we have Glenn. Then we have Helen. Card quality is pretty good. Uh, here we have Kiki. Not a huge fan of some of the art. Like her face looks a little weird in this one. We got Leticia. Next we have Mark. Again, this one, not a huge fan of the art because the space looks weird. But the miniature looked really cool. Next up we have Preston. Then we have Reno. Then Shamsia. And lastly, Yuka. No notations on the back. So I guess she doesn't have any skills. Just blood splotches. And that's what's inside the Chronicle Survivors. Miniatures and ID cards for Zombie Side Second Edition from Cool Mini or Not and Guillotine Games. Uh, really nice set, actually. The miniatures look really cool. While I don't like a few of the art pieces, the cards were pretty decent quality. Pretty standard stuff for Cool Mini or Not. Really nice quality stuff overall. Definitely a good addition if you're going to be playing the role playing game because you could use this for that or you could use it for what it's intended for, which is the Zombie Side Second Edition board game. Now, I like the board game quite a bit. It is very challenging, and these characters look pretty interesting as far as additions go, so it could be a lot of fun. Definitely worth checking out. So we've seen what's inside. You've heard my take on it. That's going to do it for this one. Thank you so much for listening and supporting the channel. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button, and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss future reviews and unboxings. If you'd like to help the channel out in other ways, pick yourself something up nice from the Teespring store, 
or you can support me monthly on Patreon or do a one-time donation via Streamlabs, which accepts PayPal. And as always, we hope to see you on the next one.